Customizing record highlights with compact layouts. Learning objectives. After completing this unit, you will be able to describe how compact layouts help your users. Create a custom compact layout. Uh, what do compact layouts do? Compact layouts control which field your users see in the highlights panel in the top of a record. They control also the fields that appear in the expanded lookup card you see when you hover over a link in the record details. And in the details section when you in expand an activity in the activities timeline. Compact layouts help you make your team more productive by presenting them with the key record information so they can easily manage their work. For example, show phone numbers and regions on an account or show stages, amounts and ownership fields on an opportunity. Which compact layouts you can highlight, whatever your user needs to see at a glance when they look at a record. As with page layout, there are separate compact layouts for each object. Here's an example of an opportunity records page. The first several fields you assign to an object's compact layout appear in the object's records highlights panel. And in the expanded lookup card you see when you hover over link and record details, the field you put first is placed at the top of bold. In this case, the highlights panel reflects the fields on the opportunity compact layout and the expanded lookup card reflects the fields from the account compact layout. So we can see an example here, the LinkedIn text tones. Let's open it. Burlington Textiles Corp of America, a similar one. This one is Weaving Plant Generator. And this is a bit different. Compact layouts also control how records display in the Salesforce mobile app. If your company uses the Salesforce mobile app, you can help your users see what they need on mobile screens where space is limited and quick recognition of records is important. Here's a sample compact layout edit page for the account object. It shows the name of the layout and the list of fields to display. New account compact layout. Trying to figure out where you can actually see this. Can't find it right now, but they should show us later. Here's the related page for the same account object in a lightning experience. You can see the account name, phone number, type, industry rating, and account owner at the top of the page. Yeah, that sounds more like this one, but still not quite. I have a few different fields here like industry rating and so on and here's what the same account record looks like in the mobile app so a lot more compact create a compact layout that's what we want to do when you create a custom object it's automatically assigned to a system default compact layout which has only one field on it the object name maria wants to call attention to the most important field on the object when her users view the audit records let's make that happen by creating a custom compact layout for the energy audit custom object Let's find and open the compact layouts node in setup for energy audit. So energy audit we still have open here through the object manager. And there we have it. Energy audit. Compact layouts. You can see the system default compact layout is assigned to the primary 
primary compact layout right now. We are going to change that. Uh, this is system default one. Click new. Energy audit compact layout. Every name. Energy audit name count annual energy usage average annual electric costs type of installation. So that's what we're going to add there. Created by last modify and owner will be omitted. And now let's see energy. And now we have the name here. Account name. Should have been saved, but maybe it wasn't. Um Assigned yet, maybe I was a bit too quick. Click compact layout assignment and then click edit assignment. Yeah, that was a problem. Okay, let's refresh this and see if it works or not. Supposed to show on the record, yeah, it looks good. Now we see the energy usage here, average uh, annual electric cost. And the type of installation should also be there somewhere. The details should be here, I guess. Maybe it's too small. Let's make it larger. Yep, it's there if we enlarge it. Seems the smaller it gets, it doesn't really show anymore. Not that great. Not sure if it's a bug or if it's supposed to be like that. But we got everything there, so it was just like missing due to the size tip user mayor solar is starting designs for its next generation of solar components to develop a baseline for the new project the design team is analyzing the typical energy saving that customers get with the current product line to support this work the team would like to see a different set of fields in the highlights panel on audit records but your summer source consultants need to see the fields that are included in the primary compact layout for the energy audit custom object what's maria to do easy she creates an energy audit record type and assigns it to the profiles of the users on the design team when she creates a different custom compact layout for the energy audit object which includes the energy fields requested by the design team finally she edits the compact layout assignment for the energy audit object to assign the new compact layout for the record type and voila where some more or less major solar consultants get highlights of the audit record details that they need, while design team members see the highlights that they need. So, 
So let's go to the challenge. When the user made a sort of salespeople are inside with the customer, they see a few key fields that they need to see right at the top of an opportunity record when they access Salesforce. Create a compact layout that will help them do that. Create a new compact layout for the opportunity object with the label new opti compact layout. Missing here. Let's add it here as well. Include these fields in the order opportunity name. Opportunity record, so this should be here. I hope. So let's create that here. And we need the opportunity name. probability. Percentage close stage stage amount opportunity owner. Let's save this, sign it, and that should be it. Let's go back to the normal sales view and see if it looks right or not. So this is supposed to be for the opportunity records. All opportunities. So we have the probability here, close date, stage, amount, what's missing, the opportunity owner, if me as the opportunity owner there just on display, probably if the size is too small, so that's something to keep in mind. So this all looks good, so we should get the 500 points. And we got the 500 points, let's tackle the next unit.